As a dog admin, I use uh, our dog discover these surveys to collect information from hundreds of people across my organization in a very structural way. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to do that. Once our dog discover user gets to uh, discover, they can navigate to any viewpoint page and uh, in the left side, they can see the list of surveys, which are basically the call to actions. So I want to show you how you can uh, control this sidebar and how you can decide on what kind of surveys um, your users will see. And uh, to do that, uh, I will use uh, one of the most commonly used uh, surveys. It's application detail survey. And uh, I already have everything pre-configured here and it's connected to the applications workspace. And uh, there is a list of questions that Discover user will see. And uh, this is the information that they can change on the viewpoint page. So I should navigate to the Discover section and click Add Survey to Discover. So what will happen next? Next, I will be able to see Update Your Application Survey in the drop-down menu. So, but I would probably want to make sure this survey is the um, most important thing that uh, our dog discover would be able to do. And it's the primary call to action. To do that, uh, I can uh, check this box set uh, as priority survey, save changes. And now you will see this uh, nice blue uh, call to action appeared in the left sidebar and you can see all these questions from the survey section appeared uh, after user clicked on this button. Uh, we call this uh, survey priority survey and it is uh, the main call to action button on this page and the secondary survey that are also connected to the workspace will be shown in this drop down menu. Uh, our doc admin can change the order of the surveys on the viewpoint editor page of the specific viewpoint. 